Hello everyone and welcome to some more Super Mario Maker 2. So we are going to play Super 1-4 World today. Um, it basically it is, I guess, a gimmick kind of world where every level is like 1-4 from the original Super Mario Bros. I don't really know what to expect. I have played the very first level. I think it was in the popular level list. But let's check it out. Let's see how it goes. Starting with 1 4, but it's unchanged. I don't know, should I be Mario for this? Maybe I should be Mario for this. Since we are playing original SMB, I'll switch to Toad another time. Actually, I guess I should start over. It's not very good housekeeping for the beginning of this video. There we go. Eek! Fire bars! Fire bars! I'll be patient here. Come on, fire bars. So I guess at the end we're going to have Bowser. Is there always a hidden block here in 1-4 of the original Super Mario Bros? Hey, let's go. We did it. We are on a roll. We are off and running. So yeah, this is the one level that I ha did play in the world because it was in the popular courses and I was just messing around with popular courses one day. I mean, it's 1-4. What more can you say? 1-4, but the guards are waiting. I mean, I can't say for sure whether the this is a an accurate recreation of 1-4. I honestly don't remember very much from... The original Super Mario Bros. Come on, Pipe, do something. Dang it, I ducked. Okay, well, we got a replacement shroom. Well, so much for the replacement shroom. Piranhas! Are there always hidden blocks in 1-4? I feel like there aren't. But I could be wrong about that, I suppose. There we go, die hammer, bro. Die piranha plants. Oh, we got a doggo. And a hidden block. Dang it. Wow, he really had guards there. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why there were so many hidden blocks, but... At least we finally made it past this level. And past the next Bowser. 1-4, but it's 80% hotter. Jeez, holy random fire, Batman. That fire bar pre placement really sucks. At least we hit a checkpoint. Holy fire. Holy fire. Holy fire. We did it. We've cleared the fire gauntlet. My god, was this annoying. <laughs> oh, and this is only level 3. There are 40 levels that we're gonna go through, so... I managed to recoup some lives. Now it's 1-4, but it's 1-1. One, one. Give me a mushroom somewhere, please. Making this video is kind of like a test for me right now. Um, I mentioned the other day about how my computer has been overheating and stuff like that. Um, so this is kind of a test to see if it can <laughs> handle recording or not. I'm still, I'm still unsure about that. But one weird thing that did happen was... So another thing that I mentioned was how my trackpad stopped working and I've been using a, a, a wireless mouse. All of a sudden, it started working again. So I have no idea what happened, what changed, but just randomly one day I was trying to wipe some dust off my computer and sure enough, 
the uh, the trackpad was working again, so I don't know what changed or why that happened, but sometimes it's best not to ask questions. Well, this is annoying. There we go. And that's the end. Let me just grab the top of the flag, get an extra life. I have a feeling we won't be seeing too many extra lives in this world. Um, but yeah, like, so far, my computer is, is acting okay, but will it hold up? I have no idea. 1-4, but it's flooded. Flooded with lava or with water? Hopefully the water. Oh, hello. Out of me ways, fishies. Give me that mush. Come on, cheap cheeps. <laughs> Go faster. Dang it, come on. Why does it look like these cheap cheeps are like floating upwards? They're like slowly drifting upwards, like <laughs> we're on a downhill slope or something. It's probably just my. Oh my god. It's probably just my imagination, but I don't know. I'm not liking all of these cheap cheeps, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> this one looks like it's higher up at least. Dude, come on. At least there's more space here now. Is there going to be a Bowser at the end? Why the hidden blocks? I don't understand. I need somebody out there to tell me if 1-4 had all of these hidden blocks. Because I don't remember there being any hidden blocks in Super Mario Bros. whatsoever. Get out of my way, Bowser. You know what? Screw it. I'll damage boost. <laughs> Just kept me to the end of this. Oh, man. I mean, it's it's not bad. I get the idea. We'll see how long I go if I can make it through all 40 levels, but so far it's it's pretty decent. Look at the chaos of this World 2 map, just full of Bowser statues. That's not at all intimidating whatsoever. 1-4, but it's Bowser from NSMBW. Whoops, I jumped a little too early there. This is a little intimidating with all of the the Bowsers on top. It's gonna be it's gonna be interesting to see how much they actually destroy. Yes, give me give me power up. How did I avoid that? Oh, this already feels so much better than the the previous levels. Well, I mean, besides the chaos of the Bowser fireballs, but other than that. Oh, so we actually need the Bowsers to destroy all of this. Interesting. Hello? I need this block destroyed, please. Oh, you were so close. There we go. And I've somehow managed to keep a propeller through all of this. Oh, I'm dead. No, I saved it. Okay. I don't know how, but I, I managed to save it somehow. Now just destroy this blockade that's gatekeeping me from getting to the end, please. There we go. I mean, I could have done without the... all of the blocks blocking my way, but otherwise... maybe the most fun level so far. The new super mechanics are always fun to deal with. 1-4 but run. 10 seconds. Interesting. Interesting. 
I appreciate the, uh, the star. Dang it. Dang it. I gotta go faster! Gotta channel my inner Sonic. Oh, well, I did kill Bowser at least. That was satisfying. There we go. Not too bad, I suppose. Only took me a few tries. But it's, I don't understand. Why are there hidden blocks everywhere? Like, they feel so, they feel so trolly. 1-4, but it's cloud flying. Oh god, it's low gravity too. Wonder if I can get away with... Not getting a, a power up or anything like that. I f I'm hoping this cloud will last me to the end. Or just put a replacement cloud that works too. I mean, this was the easiest one of them all so far, except maybe the first level. I appreciate all the, the different ideas that are going into this, though. <laughs> one four, but backwards. I hope this is a, a right-to-left level. Good. That's what I was hoping for. Gotta make sure to watch out for the hidden blocks backwards now, too. And that should be GG's. <laughs> it is indeed. Yeah, some of these levels, I mean, I know we're only in quote-unquote World 2, but some of these levels are a lot easier than some of the ones in World 1. So, might have been a good idea to do some reshuffling of the levels, but that's just me. 1-4, but from a bird's eye view. No idea what that's going to mean. Wait, are you going to scroll up and make me figure it out, not being able to see anything? Oh my god, you are. This is so mean. Actually, it's not that bad. I can see his, like, little head poking out, so... It's better than nothing. Now I can't see a thing. Where's my hidden block? Where's my hidden block? There it is! Look at them all! What did I die on? Oh, there must be stray fire from Bowser that's killing me. Well, that's stupid. <laughs> Definitely not a fan of that. But maybe if I keep my mushroom... Or at least keep it for a longer period of time... There we go. I don't know, this is the first level that I actually thought was... Not so good. But we've made it through 10 levels now. So that's always good. Just, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna give that one a boo, actually. I actively did not like that one. Alright, 1-4, but there's a bottom half. Whoops. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess... Holy big fire bars, Batman. Um, I guess we're just... Hanging out on the bottom. Jeez Louise, man, these fire bars. Oh, 
Those fire bars are something else. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Of course, they're all hidden blocks there. So now we gotta do it all over again. <laughs> Alright, well, I had to check if there are any gaps. Dude, why? Why are you doing this to me? Alright, here we go. We're doing this backwards now. Oh, I don't like this. Okay, that wasn't so bad. I don't remember what comes next. Oh yeah, this jump. Okay, alright, okay. Jump over the f Bowser fire. Now let's do this the regular way. Thank god there's a mushroom here at least. That makes this slightly more tolerable. Where does this door go? Oh, I think I saw it, like, skips ahead or something, doesn't it? Oh, it skips those big fire bars. Well, that's nice. Oh, thank goodness. I'm free of this level. Only cost me, like, 20-something lives. And the only reason why I died so much was that very first jump down was just so intimidating. I kept bonking my head or bonking into the wall or just too much bonkage. Alright, 1-4, but the Koopalings hang out. Well, this should be a good time. Hopefully they're just, like, shooting from above or something. Nope. They're full-on right there. Ah, screw you. <laughs> oh, God. Why? Why? <laughs> just, just why? Okay. Screw it, I'm damage boosting through you, Wendy. Okay. Okay. Wait, what? I need a key? Where do I get a key from? What is this? What is this? <laughs> this is so stupid. Okay, so apparently you need to kill all all of them which is really gonna suck but apparently we get a fire flower so this might not be so bad if I can just fireball them to smithereens every single one of them I've lost track of how many keys that is four I think Dang it. Okay, there's five. Ah, nuts. I really should go back and get another power-up. Screw it, we've come this far. And who am I if not a, a risk-taker? We can beat Ludwig and his Cheerios. Yeah, I totally thought this level was just avoid the Koopalings, but no, it's collect all the keys from the Koopalings. Which is uh, a little bit different. A little bit of a different idea there. Can you imagine if I was like one key short, or if I had to still fight Bowser right now? That would suck. Oh, thank god. Thank god that's over with. 1-4, but it ran out of memory. Interesting. I managed to regain another 5 lives. My goal for this was to try... Well, that sucks. Was to try not to game over, so... <laughs> okay, fair enough. I can understand why you... We ran out of memory, I suppose. That was very straightforward.
one four, but it's a boring auto scroller. I do appreciate that the last level was a freebie and that I got five more lives out of it, so we're kind of back on track. I feel like if we can finish world four with 50 lives, you know, halfway point, halfway for lives, I feel like we'll be okay. Maybe. Who knows what's to come, though. This looks like another freebie level, but I don't want to underestimate it. Gotta stay vigilant. This really is a boring auto-scroller. <laughs> there's literally nothing. There's no fire bars. There's no fire bowser. Like, that lava level in... What was it in World 1? I think it was? Was super ridiculous. Why is this in, like, World 3? But I guess, like, in World 1, it, it entices you to keep playing. Like, if this... Oh, man, that Koopa Troll. Um, if this level was in... World 1, I could see people giving up, but they put more exciting levels in World 1 and I guess some more not-so-exciting ideas later on in the world. Which, fair enough. 1-4, but the lava is rising. I hope the lava falls too, honestly. I don't know if it's gonna fall, folks. The lava did not fall, ladies and gentlemen. I actually think we want to avoid everything and just run through as fast as we can. Yes, that is indeed the case. There we go. Not too bad. By the way, just a little computer update for all of you. My uh, red and blue flashing lights of doom are blinking again. I know that you're very interested and invested in this computer saga. Um, but I think I'm probably going to go and get it fixed one of these days. Maybe it'll be fixed by the time this video comes out. All right. Well, this is another interesting map here that we have for World 4. Let's start in Treeland. 1-4, but it's long forgotten. Maybe we'll get some, like, overgrown vines and stuff. <laughs> we actually did. I'm just waiting for, a, like, a 1-4, but you're Link or something. 1-4, but you're Super Mario 2. 1-4, but you're in Super Mario Land. Hope we get some different themes in this. Ooh, extra... Oh my god, I didn't see the spike there. I just wanted the extra life, man. There we go. Claim the extra life. I assume you want me to go back down there. Nope. <laughs> we were fine running across the top. Fair enough. Wow, I actually got the world record. Interesting. 1-4 but upside down. Oh god. I'm gonna have to stand on my head for this one so I can see the screen properly. The upside down, does that only happen in the nighttime theme? Is it nighttime ground? Or like, what's the theme that allows you upside down? Space, maybe? I don't... Dang it. My god, I didn't see the fire. Alright, I'm just gonna be patient. Now I'm not gonna be patient. <laughs> I had a mushroom, so I was willing to risk it all for that one. Alright, I managed to get three lives back. Time for 1-4, but it's bad. I can't wait. Dude. 
<laughs> this is so stupid. We already had the one that was... Oh, man, I should blow that block up. We are... Dude! I was gonna say, we already had the boring ones. Now we've got the... The boring bomb excavation ones. Which isn't too bad if it's like a few blocks, but... When it's like a whole whack of blocks like this one... Not so fun. Which I assume is what the creator was going for. There we go, that should finish them off. Really, fish? Wait. Where do I get a key from? Is it up here? Alright, fair enough. Pick a door. Dude, why? <laughs> why did you do this? At least this time I know there's a fish in that block. But now which one do I choose? I guess I'll try right? Thank god we chose... Why, man? Why? Okay, so I decided to look this up in the level viewer, and this whole section right here is full of invisible blocks, except for the couple of gaps to the left of each of these, I guess, whatever you want to call it, the, um, the blocks that are there. Also, this right here is a pit. My god, I'm an idiot. That's a pit where you can get soft locks, so got to avoid that too. This does not look pleasant whatsoever. I think I saw a star there, though. So if I can, like, grab that star somehow... There we go. And I got some extra lives out of it, which is always nice. But other than that, this was indeed a very bad level. <laughs> though I did like... How when those two doors were there, when I went through the, the door, it did look like a smiley face. But here's a heart for your troubles, my friend. All right. 1-4, but Bowser moved to space. Hey, we got another new soup level. I'll take that. Got some more low gravity. Which is always nice. Whoops, that's not at all what I meant to do. And now I paid the price. Easy enough. Please no hidden blocks. Thank God. Holy man. Bowser, you need to chill, man. Stay off the trampolines. There we go. Not too bad, I suppose. 1-4, but it's on a dry bone shell. Hey, we have a clear condition. So one thing I haven't really talked about is that... Um, oh, God. There's going to be fire bars, invisible fire bars from underneath. Um, I haven't talked about how I started a new job. Um, so this is actually the first video that I'm recording since I've started that new job. And um, yeah, it's been very interesting so far. It's... Um, I'm not going to lie, I've been feeling really stressed because it's always very stressful when you're starting a new job and stuff like that. But, um, yeah, it's been a week so far, and so far the kids have been really good, and I feel like my sort of, like, social anxiety and anxiety towards new situations has kind of lessened, which is good, um, but it's definitely a big adjustment for me.